Okay, so the guest conference returns after the important midday of the Irani Trophy, and we've seen the bowlers really struggle it out. I've got a very happy Sharda Ugra and S. Rajesh with me. Now, I don't know why the happiness, because we've got uh, two spinners, Harbhajan and Pragyan Oja, who've really, really had to toil, out of which Harbhajan's got uh, the more wickets. So Sharda's got her guess, right? Rajesh will obviously have his own word to say, but I'm going to go to Sharda first. Sharda, Harbhajan, you, you guessed it, right? He's got three wickets. What do you make of his performance so far? I thought it was, uh, you know, it, it started off a little bit uncertain. You know, I didn't think he was bowling with any kind of confidence like he should have been. But the moment he got a wicket, it was like him and the fielders and everyone was all over the batsman. He was a bit lucky to get that get that first wicket. But honestly, you know, for a bowler of Harbhajan's sort of reputation, three wickets is just about enough. It's, I mean, it's not just about enough. You need it like a big bag. You know, how batsmen for 100, you need bowlers to be able to run through sides. I know that uh, this is Bombay and it's difficult and the wicket is not good, but you're uh, supposed to play for India and, you know, so we need we need some more. We need, we need a sort of bigger performance. I don't know whether Rajesh will agree with me on that, but that's what I think. Let's go straight to Rajesh then. Rajesh, uh, you picked a combination of Pragyan Oja and Shami Emma to do better. You uh, before we went on air, you conveniently said it's the combination that I picked. So you shouldn't. You should say you did say Harbhajan would do better than Oja. But individually, based on their performances, do you think Harbhajan was a good bowler? Or we had pretty poor. We had a lot of luck going for him today. Well, compared to Oja, he was he was a bit better. Uh, but I agree with Shada. The way he started, he was giving too many leg side deliveries. People were tucking him around for singles, and he really didn't look the force. And like Shada says, you really need to be able to take you know big hauls of four, five, six wickets in an important match like this. But then when Sachin is in, in this form, then I think no Indian bowler can do anything about it. And it would probably have been better if you know, Kapil Dev had come down from the commentator's box and been bowling as compared to the lot that we saw on the ground today. So I think uh, we all know that uh, how, how good this uh, Indian attack is. Given the circumstances, I, I didn't expect anything better from uh, any of them. Yeah, you've gone you've gone for the age old Indian answer of just put it on Tendulkar when the bowlers don't do well. But Rajesh, you know what? We're a very ruthless lot here at the guest conference. So whether you said you picked the combination or not, we're going to say that you picked Pragya and Oja to do better than Harbhajan Singh. And Sharda has got you one up on that one. So Sharda's guessing seems to be far more accurate. Sharda, feel free to uh, <laughs> put uh, Rajesh on his not so accurate predictions in spite of being the numbers man. In spite of being the numbers man, but uh, I mean, I have the greatest respect for Rajesh and his numbers and my numbers are usually crap. I just went purely on gut instinct. I mean, let's be fair, what happened to Sri Sant? You know, Sri Sant's had a pretty bad match. He's had a horrendous match. He's been all over the place. He's not been sort of nippy enough. And he's not looked like uh, anyone who looks at him and says, this is the guy to pick. You know, you look at, you probably say, okay, why don't you give Ishwar Pandey a chance uh, uh, ahead of Shrishan? Because you're saying, look, Shrishan should, should have done more. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to grind Rajesh down because he got it wrong between Pragyan and Harbhajan. But yeah, you wanted to see a, a, a lot more consistency with Harbhajan today, I think, in terms of the line that he bowled. And Tendulkar is Tendulkar, you know, but there are other batsmen as well. You, you'll get a chance to bowl to them. And, and, and that's when you need it to sort of gra grab a big haul. I'm just being uh, generous here, but I know that if I get it wrong, I'll just get dumped out from a great oh, point. <laughs> very well. Rajesh, last word from you. Female gut versus male statistics. Which one's the most superior <laughs> one in cricket assessment? It's it's all form on the day. It, <laughs> and anyway, I'll, I'll remember this, Shada, for, for next time. <laughs> so, so next time when you get it wrong, I'll remember this. I'll go easy on you as well. Yeah, we don't like to see thanks, you guys thanks, going easy. Thanks a lot, guys. We go. We don't like to see you guys going easy, but we let you go on this one. Uh, thanks a lot so far. Just to keep the score, Shardas picked you on this one, Rajesh. We're going to come back at the end of day four and see what happens with the bowlers. Thanks a lot for joining us, guys.